CDC official warns Americans it's not a question of if coronavirus will spread, but when. One of the top officials at the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention warned Americans on Tuesday that health experts foresee the novel coronavirus that has killed thousands spreading in the United States. It says, now is the time for U.S. businesses, hospitals, and communities to begin preparing for the possible spread of COVID-19. CDC continues to work with business, education and healthcare sectors, encouraging employers to be prepared. Symptoms similar to a cold. News of the uptick in U.S. cases comes as the worldwide count topped 80,000 people, the overwhelming majority in China. At least 2,700 people have died. The emergence of hundreds of cases outside China, namely, in Italy and South Korea, has served to disrupt global supply chains, corporate profits and American and international markets. The viruses can make people sick, usually with a mild to moderate upper respiratory tract illness, similar to a common cold. Coronavirus symptoms include a runny nose, cough, sore throat, possibly a headache and maybe a fever, which can last for a couple of days. For those with a weakened immune system, the elderly and the very young, there's a chance the virus could cause a lower, and much more serious, respiratory tract illness such as pneumonia or bronchitis. There are a handful of human coronaviruses that are known to be deadly. There is no specific treatment, but research is underway. Most of the time, symptoms will go away on their own and experts advise seeking care early. People with symptoms that feel worse than a standard cold should see their doctor. Doctors can relieve symptoms by prescribing a pain or fever medication. The CDC says a room humidifier or a hot shower can help with a sore throat or cough. Drink plenty of fluids. Get rest and sleep as much as possible. People may be able to reduce their risk of infection by avoiding those who are sick, avoiding touching their eyes, nose and mouth, and washing hands often with soap and water and for at least 20 seconds. You've just heard about COVID-19 latest news from the Newspaper Reader channel. For more update news, please subscribe to this channel. Thank you.